Hi everyone, it's Maggie and I want to share some happy mail with you. Uh, this is from Trisha, a little shabby chic, and um, she sent me um, a surprise and this is the card she sent. I love the card and the uh, the contents are personal, so I am going to put that aside. And I will tell you right now, <clears throat> this is going to be um, at least a two-part video because she, like, spo spoiled me unbelievably. That's all I can say. So um, I did open everything because um, when you get a package from Trisha, you just can't wait until you're able to do a video. I, you have to open it right away. And that's what I did. I was so excited. Um, she had to, you know, take a year off from YouTube and I have just missed her so much. And I am so very glad and thankful that she's back. And uh, she just means so much to me. She has a special place in my heart, and she knows that, and um, I just absolutely adore her. So anyways, let's get to it. Um, she sent me a lot of goodies, and these were wrapped up in this beautiful piece here. So let me show you that. It's gorgeous, and I'll put these on the side. And she sent me this beautiful tassel, and it's made with, um, I think these are seed beads, and it's silver. It is absolutely gorgeous. And then this piece here, which I love, the roses are like velvet, and it's just beautiful. I will definitely use that on something special. And then she sent me some trims in white. And this is one of them. And I hope I might have to find something with some color in it. But I think you'll be able to see. And I'm sorry for the shadows. It's it's um, late at night. And uh, I don't know why I'm casting a shadow. But there's that one. It's gorgeous. And then this one here which I love. I love the dangle trims. And this is a flower dangle. Let me, I want to try to keep everything together. And then she sent this, uh, let me see, show you the trims first. This one here, which is beautiful. And this one, oh my gosh, this is absolutely gorgeous. And I won't even be able to get it all in camera. But here's the top of it. I'll show you that. And then look at the dangles, the wide circles. Oh my gosh, Tris, this is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I love that. It is just stunning. And then she sent me... Um, a couple of, I think they're, they'd be called collars, I think. And this flowery one, look at how beautiful that is. There's that one. And then there's this one. And I've never seen one like this that has the, um, the dangles. It's just gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I love it. And then this piece here. I love using these in my fabric books. These vintage pieces. Thank you so much, Trisha. I just, oh, I just love everything. And then this piece here. It's just beautiful. 
She finds the most amazing things at their car boot sales. And then there's two of these. Um, I think they're placemats. And I'll show you this. That there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you just... You overwhelmed me, Trisha. You sent me so much. And there's a box on on its way to Trisha's now. And I hope she likes what I sent her. So there's the first. And then also there was this beautiful little um, flowery. It looks almost like a wreath, but I don't want to take it out of the package. But I love the colors of these flowers. And then, look at that. She sent me this angel. It's just beautiful. Thank you so much. Okay, and then, of course, Trisha knows my favorite color is lavender. <laughs> oh, before I start with the lavender, she sent me this beautiful piece here. Pearl and rhinestone. Okay. And now onto the lavender. And Trisha, you have to tell me, did you crochet these? But they'll make perfect flowers. I love those. You'll have to tell me if you did make those. Because if you did, those are those are going in the hutch with with um the things that I that you send me that I absolutely can't use or won't use. Here's a um, beautiful embroidered trim. And the shades that she got, I know she uses the Dylon. Um, I found one packet at my um, Joann's and it's the China Blue. I, I haven't had a chance to use it yet, but um, they didn't have the lavender. And look at she... And this, there's all different shades, and I don't know, some of them, these lighter ones may not um, show up, but there is a lavender hue to these uh, butterflies. And then here's a piece. She also sent me snippets, which I absolutely love. And then there's this dangle one. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. Look at that. And I just love the lavender shade. It is beautiful and she sent me this piece here and they're so soft I also have to ask her how she gets everything soft after she dyes it gorgeous and then there's this here and I think I have this one in white and look at it took the dye so well And then there's this um, eyelet. It's like a gathered eyelet. I love using this for flowers. And here's a smaller eyelet one. And it came out a little bit lighter, I think. Love that. Okay, and one more. And they're just gorgeous shades. And then there's this one. I love this one. And I know she sent me uh, this in probably, um, oh, it's I know it's been over a year. So uh, the last time I think she sent me Happy Meal, um, I think it's like, a, it's almost like a creamy, beigey color and look at how it took the lavender and then there's this one look at how beautiful and there's a piece of lace look at that wide uh, I think this might be an eyelash trim actually just beautiful and then this piece here. And then this bridal applique piece. Look at how beautiful. I love that the pearls, of course, stay white. 
and the rest takes the color and it just makes it stand out. And then there's this one. They're all just so gorgeous and oh my gosh, they're all so soft. And then there's these little ones, look at that. I love the little ones. And look at, there's another one. And then there's this one. Look at, that's the front. Absolutely gorgeous. And then there's this embroidered one. Love that. Look at that. Oh, I hope the color's coming through. And then there's a couple of flowers. And I love this. The petals, the inner of the petals um, came out lavender. But the, um, the white stitching around it um, it's not white white, but it's a lot lighter, in, including these, than the petals. I love that. It looks like, um, like a double color effect. And then there's these. Oh, everything is just gorgeous, Trisha. Thank you so, so much. I will, I'm in lavender heaven. They're just, oh, I love that trim too. And then here's another small one. And I love using these in my fabric books. Um, I often use these to frame my um, images. And here's another one. And these are hearts. Look at that. And then here's another one. Oh, they're just beautiful. And then here's some little daisies. I call them daisies. And this piece here, this snippet, love this. It's so dainty. And then there's this. This came out much lighter but you do see the um, hint of lavender. And then there's this one. And this one. And this is like, almost like a, like a stretchy, um, but not quite, uh, like a Chinese braid almost, I think. And then there's this piece. Look at that. And this one, oh, I love this one. Look at that. Love it. And then that one. And this flowery one. And then here's a here's a piece that she dyed. And then here's um, another piece of flowery material. And this is like a stretchy material. And then here's a piece of eyelash trim. And this almost came out like a pinkish color. It's just beautiful. And it's like never ending. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at. And then some. she sent me some cheesecloth that she dyed. And then she sent me some doilies from, look at those. And then there's a few of these. And then this 
beautiful one. And oh my gosh, I love this one. I love the the da thinner daintier ones. These are just beautiful. And then this one with the flower in the middle. <clears throat> and then two um, fabric ones. And then this beautiful piece here. And then oh, here's some more cheesecloth. And then this piece here. They're square doilies, I think. Yep. They're square doilies, and she sent me some of those. Look at that. Love those. And I think I am going to end this first part here. And um, I will be back again with uh, part two. So thank you so much for this, Trisha. Thank you for dyeing these. And, oh, my gosh, I just love it all. Okay, everybody, I'll be back again soon.